TGIF, welcome to the Beamish Blogcast, May 15th, 2015. Rather unsettled heading into the next 24 hours as a cold front approaches from Southern California. Here's how it's going to impact you if you're traveling east of Metro Tucson. Patchy blowing dust possible this afternoon near the Wilcox Playa. Overnight, roadways wet, maybe a little bit of ponding. And in the higher elevations, we're talking about rain switching over to snow around 7,000 feet. So late night travel to the White Mountains or the cabin in Summerhaven may have to deal with some snow. Front right now off the Southern California coast, San Diego record rainfall today. Meanwhile, in Northern Arizona, over seven inches of snow at the National Weather Service forecast office in Flagstaff. All part of this storm system that's going to be moving in our direction. Gusty winds this morning and this afternoon. We do have a wind advisory out from noon until seven o'clock this evening for Santa Cruz and Cochise counties. This is where the strongest winds will be gusts as high as 50 miles per hour coming out of the southwest. Slight chance at a couple of late day thunderstorms, but that rain chance will increase to 70% late tonight into tomorrow morning. This is future cast around 1 a.m. on Saturday. Best chance for rain is going to be cells, Tucson, Safford, and points north. You get south of that, showers and storms a little spottier in nature. And you can see up in the White Mountains that rain switching over to snow. Cold front is out of here quickly. I think it's gone after lunchtime tomorrow. Gradual clearing, and then the rest of the weekend looking fantastic. Forecast rainfall totals, I think, a tenth to three tenths of an inch of rain. Tucson sells to Safford, points north of that. Likely a tenth of an inch or less as you head south of the metro area. This includes you in Sierra Vista and Douglas. 70s now, 80s and 90s returning as we head into next week. 91 Monday, partly cloudy skies with some gusty winds developing. Overnight lows next several nights dropping into the 50s and 60s. Hard to talk about triple-digit temperatures in the forecast like this, but log on to KVOA.com and get signed up for our ice break contest. Date and time down to the minute you think we hit 100 degrees for the first time this year. Thanks for logging on. Have a great weekend. I'll see you later on today for News 4 Tucson at noon.